Hey, this is a topic a lot of you have asked me privately, and I actually had to think a little bit about this as well. It's with regards to mailing out to your customers or even your clients, or maybe your mailing newsletter subscribing list thing. You know what I'm talking about. I'm now using sender.net. Now, why am I using sender.net? Because I bet a lot of you maybe have not heard about it. You will have heard of MailChimp. The big problem with this is that is unless you're going to pay for it. Now, let me just backtrack a bit. I'm talking about people that want to get something set up for free. Now, a lot of you that are happy to pay a premium, you go for it. Find the best solution for you. But for those of you out there that kind of you don't have a lot of resources or capital to throw at this, if you want a free solution, Sender.net is one I definitely recommend. But here's why. MailChimp, you can use for free but you're restricted to 500. If you try and go over that, the free option won't be allowed. So MailChimp says, hey, you can use our services. You're allowed to send a thousand emails, but you can't have more than 500 contacts. Now think about, let me just explain that. That means that if you have a subscribe list of 500, you can only send two emails per month. Don't look at this and go, oh, I can send a thousand emails. No. That's a thousand divided by your number of subscribers. So you could send an email and then another email two weeks time. That's not totally great. If you go to MailerLite, MailerLite um, um, was actually one we used to use a long, long time ago as well. However, you are restricted up to a thousand subscribers. So double what you get with MailChimp, but now it's 12,000. So if you've got a list of a thousand, you could send 12 emails a month. That's not too bad, actually. That's quite reasonable. It, you are restricted to a thousand. So if you've got a list just over that or you're heading towards it, this might not work for you. Active campaign is one we've used a lot as well. The only drawback to this, though, is what do you actually get in terms of the pricing? I have to say, though, the way they do their price and explain things isn't totally clear, but you could end up spending $49 per month when you have a list which is about a thousand or just over that. It ain't the great. It's It's got loads of really good features, but it, the prices do start to add up. Now, here's why I've gone to sender.net. And if anyone has been receiving emails as part of our Elemental website course um, that has gone out or any other mastery module, you'll now be getting emails via sender.net. And it is super easy to set up and use. The pricing for this and the reason why I decided to use this, because I'm only using it for the courses. And again, I'll explain why I've had to go and get this. is because this allows two and a half thousand subs with 15,000 emails per month. Now, unless if you if I send, let's say you got two and a half thousand and I send an email a week, that's 10,000 emails per month. You are more than covered. That's two and a half thousand free. And if you're smaller, you're growing until you now need to move on to another system like a more premium one. This is going to cover you for a very long time. So I used it for the very first time yesterday when I set up an email. I, I registered and all of that, set up my email and sent it out. It's basically an update of our website, the Elemental website course one. And it was sent out to 388 people. And I can see that 30%, it went out literally an, uh, about an hour ago, actually, just roughly just under an hour ago. 118 people, 30% have opened it. And there's been, I can see there's only been 13 clicks because there were URLs on there. That's not a fantastic conversion rate, but I get some stats on there about what was going on. This is so simple. We are using WooCommerce for people to go and access our course. In WooCommerce, okay, you will have the option for customers. And this is a fake website, by the way. So you're probably not going to see much going on here. Okay, this is my fake website. I build stuff on. What you would normally do is go and hit the word download over there and it will download all of your customer emails um, in one go into your downloads folder. When you then go over to sender.net, what you can do is start a new campaign or go to your subscribe list. You can have them all in one list or you can set up groups. Now, if I was to go to add subscribes, I can import that CSV file. But what if I've added in that CSV file and now next week I want to add some further customers? Here's what's so cool. You can take another download and add it in. Go over here and just copy paste the emails in. And when it adds it to your list, it checks for duplicates. Duplicate email and it, and it kicks it out so that your list is always kept robust and accurate. And when it comes to setting up emails, I mean, I'm telling you, this is super, super good, right? 
you can go and set up your subject. You can go put in some further preview text. So in the email, this is what it would look like. You can then do is hit save and continue. And again, this is how simple it is. It gives you a ton of templates to use. This is ridiculous, okay? And I go to my template. I know it says 404 page not found, but ignore that, okay? I don't know why it does that. It kind of scares you at first. Now here's a template I've been using with how I was setting up, but this is what I really like about the interface. It's literally drag and drop. You can drag things in, you can rearrange them, you can go in, you can modify the setting. There's so much to go on here. And what's really cool about this is if I go to design settings, I'm gonna save this as a template. You can send a test email, so you do that. You go and stick in an email address and you get it within like seconds, like, like a second, not even that probably, it's that quick. You can even do email preview. So preview, how does it look on the mobile and the desktop? I mean, what you get here is so much slick and easy compared to what you might have been doing before. And of course, yet yeah, there are features if you want to, you know, um, put a link or something on your WordPress website or wherever for a mailing list, you know, subscribe now and it will feed it through. If you go to save and continue, it will then say to you right now, where do you want this to go? Now, I'm not going to send it to the course members. I'm just going to send it to the test group because I'm just doing this for the video purposes. So I'm going to send it to the test group or you might want to send it to another group. So remember, the more, you know, you can have as many groups as you want within two and a half thousand if it's free. You hit save and continue. Now, you will get this message. Now, I don't have to worry about this because I've tested it. Because I'm using SiteGround, it goes, hey, the SPF record is not verified. I did not have an issue with this, okay? If you want to go and resolve this by going in and sticking in a text record, you can do. But I have found that, there you go, verify, sorry. You can do, but I did not have to do that. At the top over here, we have schedule to send. I'm going to click that, and basically you go and pick your date and your time, and you hit schedule, and then it will schedule it in, and basically sender.net. See down here. Uh, I've got a 15,000 limit per month. I've sent out 403 because I sent it to the first batch and then there was like three or four test emails I did where I was sending it to myself and other people check everything worked. Sender.net, free, two and a half thousand, uh, 15, two and a half thousand subscribers, 15,000 emails. I'm really liking this. I'm in Rand Web Squad and I hope you like, subscribe, share and follow. Go and check out our Elemental website course. I'll see you soon. Never break, always fight, never quit. Do it right, play the game, win it life. Have no shame, there's no time. Feel the pain, let the grind. I could change in my mind. Pick a lane, commit and climb. The only way to win it life. I never miss that.